Right now, the two deputies who were shot are recovering today. Shot near Hag Lake in rural Washington County yesterday afternoon while they were searching for someone suspected of stealing guns. Elise Haas is live outside of OHSU Hospital, where at least one of the deputies is recovering this afternoon. Elise. Yes, Ken. So we know one of these deputies suffered serious injuries and he had to be taken by life flight to the hospital, but he is expected to recover. The second deputy suffered non life threatening injuries and the shooter underwent surgery, but it's still unclear right now of what condition he's currently in. But to catch you up on when all of this started and what led up to this deputy involved shooting. That it all began with a theft call from a home near Hag Lake. A family reported a man stealing their guns and then taking off into the woods. Deputies then used police dogs. They had the air support team out there and the tactical teams too in order to find him. A couple hours later, they did, and bullets exchanged. Two deputies were shot, and that armed man was hit. He actually continued running despite being injured, and authorities caught him half an hour later. We talked to the law. law Law enforcement right after this shooting unfolded. Our priority right when our deputies were shot was to getting them to help and medevacking them out. We have seen a flood of prayers and thoughts and encouragement pour in to our law enforcement family and the family of the injured deputies. And I just thank our community for their support. And we saw many officers from other agencies come here to OHSU yesterday to give their support and encouragement to the deputies who were hurt in this shooting. And I was out here this morning and I saw even more law enforcement still out here overnight just to show their support for them. But as of right now, the sheriff has not released the name of the deputies who were shot or the armed man as well. So once they do, we'll be sure to let you know. Reporting live here at OHSU, Elise Haas, Coin 6 News. And of course, we wish those deputies the best. Thank you, Elise.